Greetings, my friends, to the very last episode of Skyrim Scenarios. You know, I think it's high time we finally finished this series. It's been going on for far too long now. I think I made the the first ever episode like over two years ago, maybe now. I don't remember, but anyway, it's it, it's time we just ended it, and you know we have one more scenario left. So so let's just do it now, shall we? Okay, so the final scenario is, my friends, I have been soul trapped by a necromancer right there. A strong soul is all you have and all you need. Well, I've been soul trapped, so I don't really have that now, do I? Thanks for mocking me. All right, let's go sleep in this here bed and see what it like what it's like to be soul trapped. You've been defeated and your soul has been ripped from your body and trapped into a soul gem. That's not good. <laughs> no, I, I get. <laughs> Uh, well, that's not good now, is it? <laughs> Alright, cool. Well, let's just figure out how to get out of this joint, shall we? Isn't this like Superman's little base of operations? Like, if I click one of these, like, a vision of his father will appear or something. So, we're, we're still butt naked and we have no items to speak. We've got five green apples, so that's cool. The, uh, the apples always manage to make their way in inside the soul gem when you die. <laughs> Everything else goes, but you, you get five apples. Ooh! Activate core of the gem. Wabam! Oh, okay. I thought was, I thought it was gonna like teleport somewhere. Please can't you spare a septum? <laughs> the goddamn beggar mod. Shall I ask you? Uh, shall I ask the core of the gem if I can get a septum? I wonder if it give me any septums. Please, gem, can you spare a septum or two? Get a job, lazy peg. <laughs> 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 Oh, sorry I asked. You know the divines don't look upon greedy people favorably. <laughs> Here, don't say I didn't give you anything. Now get out of my way. Insufferable urchin. They gave me a saw and a wooden ladle. <laughs> oh, this is why you... <laughs> oh, this is what happens when mods conflict. <laughs> a gem... A gem... A gem... A gem just called me a lazy beggar. <laughs> Tell me to get lost. <laughs> All right, let's just do the quest now. What am I doing here? What happened? You mean you don't know? Your soul has been ripped from your body and is now kept here into what you know as a soul gem. Okay, fair enough. I have trapped many a foe into soul gems myself, so I've been soul trapped. Yes, most definitely. It's strange that you retain some sense of self. You must be very strong-willed. But it shall wane off and all that remains is your spiritual energy. It's only a matter of time. You mean that no one has ever escaped? Souls escape all the time, but only at my will. Okay, this guy seems uh, a bit controlling here. And what is your will, good gem? My will is to release you in due time. Everything has a time, and yours hasn't come yet. Okay, so do we just wait then? Is that all we do here? Anyway, I could convince you to set me free? Well, you don't seem to be fading away like the others. And the last centuries have been boring. I do enjoy a game of riddle with mortals. <gasps> We're going to have to play a game of riddles, are we? That seems very fun. So if I solve your riddle, you will set me free. Yes, why not? Okay, core of the gem. Deal, ask your riddle, good sir. Alright, let's see here. The one who makes it, sells it. The one who buys it, never uses it. The one that uses it, never knows that he's using it. What is it? Dude, that's a coffin. That's easy. I've heard that one before. It's a coffin, my guy. A hide helmet. <laughs> no, dude, it's a coffin, man. Come on, it's so clearly a coffin, my 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 dude, gem. In indeed. <laughs> Will you let me go now? As agreed. Come back to visit me sometimes. <laughs> okay. Um. I'm still butt naked. Thanks, core of the gem. You've given me no. What's that over there? Who are these guys? Were you coming to rescue me? Well, it's too late. I got up myself. I played a game of riddles. A very easy game of riddles at that. But my dudes, I have nothing. Let me see. Yeah, I've got. I've only got four apples. Uh, oh, no, it's going to be chilly in these waters. Hello, good sirs. Uh, I've been knocked unconscious and I'm hurt. Can you help me get back to my feet? Help you. I'll help you relinquish your earthly... Listen, I have four apples. Don't do this to me. Listen, take, take my four apples. Just take it. I'm not going to fight over four apples. Just mark my words, this isn't over. Taking my four apples. Here, just take it. Just just get out of my sight, you thieves. You're taking my last and only apples. If I push you off the edge, what are you going to do about it, huh? Like, if I whack you off the edge like that and you, and you fall down to your death, I'll take your gear. Yes, if I can push you off. Just come on, one more little push. That's all you need. Yes. Come on. 
You walk away while I kill your companions, and I will take their gear. Yes, that's it. Come on. Straight off the edge. Come on. One does not simply take my apples, you... There we are. Look, dead. Yes, just what I wanted. Now you're next. You hear that? The crunch of bones. Your friend just died. Your orcish companion. Oh, shit. He's still alive. He's swimming away. Oh, this will kill you. This one will kill you. Damn it. You didn't die. Alright, I guess I'm just going to go with you guys on, a, on an adventure because this has been a short episode, so I need to do something else. Is someone there? No, someone's not there, but I'm hoping you're a damn it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not very kind now. I gave you my apples. What more do you want? Did the f other guy die up here? Yes! Thank you for saving me, good sirs! Yes! Kill her! Yes, you've killed the orc. And let me just watch you kill this goddamn thief. I'll get my apples back off your cold, dead body. Thank you, Vigilant of Stendar. You are you guys are you gonna kill her? Listen, I'll go pick up the axe and I'll finish her off then. Come on. Were these guys coming to I think these guys were coming to save me. You know. Let me just get the axe. Let me just go get the gear off the uh off the other guy. I guess it all worked out in my favour in the end. Thank you, Vigilant of Stendars. I can always rely on your kind presence to to save me. And now I've got a Warhammer, and now I'm gonna- I'm still bloody naked though, pretty much. Alright, if you, if you guys want bash her skull in, I'm gonna do it, okay? I'm gonna make sure she dies. BOOM! Done. There we are. Can I join you guys now? Because- Oh yes, let me take that armor actually. Get lost, you goddamn- Now, the other one who took my apples is still out there, so... We need to find her. She ran, ran this way. Are you guys gonna come? Alright, I guess I'm going to be hunting for my apples all, all by myself. Looks like we found a new purpose for this video, is to hunt down the person that took our gear. Now, is it a quest I want? No, it's not. I'm hoping I can run into her this way, though. Ow, you're burning my skin a lot. Ah. Novice Fire Mage. Ugh. Now, where did she go? She has my precious apples, okay? I want my apples back, you goddamn fool. This is a soldier of some kind. Uh, nothing of value. Where are my apples, good sir? Listen, don't do this. Boom. I told you not to do this. Mistakes were made on your parts. Human flesh, these sick, these sick people. I'll take that cloak though, that looks like a very tasty cloak. Alright, I don't want to die, so I'm going to leave this place with my newfound gear. Thank you, good sir. Very kind of you. I better go take these clothes as well, because, you know, these will help me in the cold. There we are, that's way better. I look so cool now, holy crap. Look at that. Anyway, I don't think we'll find the apple thief anytime soon, so I think it's fruitless to, uh, fruitless, because, you know, apples and stuff. Anyway, I think it's fruitless to track her down. She is long gone with my precious apples, and, um, I'll never find her again. If only the vigilance of Stendar came sooner before I was cruelly robbed of all my delicious apples. And unfairly robbed as well, because, you know, I just escaped from a soul trapped uh, necromancer, so... Oh, well. We, um... We have some newfound gear now, anyway. You, you filthy cur! Come at me. I'll slash you down. Okay, so yeah, my dude. So that scenario was pretty damn quick, if I do say so myself. We, uh, we, we passed that riddle with much ease and got out of there very quickly. But you know, this does mark the the very last episode of Skyrim scenarios. So it looks like there's some a camp up here. So yeah, my friends, this marks the very last episode of Skyrim Scenarios. We're, we're all done. We have done every single scenario. There are no more scenarios to do. And that's pretty much the end of it right there. So my friends, thank you for watching. If you liked what you see, feel free to leave a like. And if you do want to see more, you know, consider subscribing. You don't have to, but the option's always there. My friends, your viewership is always appreciated. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.